My name's Johnny. <laughs> hey, how's it going, Joker Famous Boy? Haha, ha, Joker, aka the Black Joker, back at it again. Nothing bad for you, for you guys. And today, as you guys know, ULs are officially out. And of course, we got ourselves a new big time upgrade in the trenches. I want to say big time because Max Crosby wasn't playing bad, but it's an upgrade nonetheless. You know what I'm saying? But we got Justin Tuck, man. Very happy about this. Again, it just gets more abilities for pretty much the same amount of AP that Max already had on him. And honestly, for a second, I, I almost forgot he played for the Raiders. I, I think he had one of those 10 years like Jerry Rice playing on the Seahawks. You know what I'm saying? Just back end of the career type thing because obviously he's known for playing for the giants but let's go ahead and get into his stats of course get you guys gameplay now joker fam justin tuck comes in at six foot five 96 speed 99 acceleration 98 strength 94 tackle 95 play rec with a 97 block shed 91 power move and a 99 finesse move now again comparing him to max right obviously speed is going to be the same that's not really a surprise there acceleration is going to be a little bit better Better. Well, his acceleration is maxed out for Justin Tuck, but strength is going to be better. Tackling is going to be going to maxes. Yeah, it's going to go to max actually. But play rec, block shed, it's all going to go to Justin. You know what I'm saying? They got the same power move, so that doesn't really matter. But and I believe their finesse would be the same, if I'm not mistaken. It, it might be the same. So again, Justin Tuck, these guys are very like they got the same, almost the same weight. They're obviously the same height, so. Again, we're going to get very good pass rushing from Justin Tuck, I would imagine. But the biggest thing about this upgrade is, is that obviously he gets more abilities for the same amount of AP as um, Max Crosby. So double or nothing, inside stuff, edge threat elite, all for two AP on Justin Tuck. And of course, we're rocking um, Unstoppable Force as his X Factor. Again, it's just the base X Factor. It's not, he doesn't start off with it. But again, I choose you. I choose to run inside stuff. Again, you could go no outsiders if you wanted to, but I, I prefer inside stuff. It just is what it is. I don't really run into a lot of people running stretch and things of that nature. It's primarily people running a 01 trap or doing run plays out of shotgun. Most run plays out of shotgun are inside zone type plays anyway. So that's why I run inside stuff on Justin Tuck and obviously on Maniac also. But Joker Fam, this is what No Fly Zone is looking at, looking like as a whole. Right now, as you guys can see, we are 51 out of 50 still on the Raiders theme team. Again, don't know where I'm gonna use that last filler spot at, but currently right now, we just don't have a need for it. Um, receiving what our offensively, this is what the offense is looking like. We could possibly use that last filler spot on maybe, maybe a receiver, I, I guess. I, I really don't know, but Again, we already know we're getting Calvin soon, and so I, I really don't see the point. But regardless of all that, this is what the offense is looking like. That was what No Fly Zone was looking like. But Joker Fam, that is our new upgrade, Justin Tuck. Again, big time player in the trenches for sure. Again, I think he will have pretty much the same amount of impact as Max. You know what I'm saying? Obviously, the stats are very much the same. Again, you just get one extra AP for the, I mean, one extra ability. There we go, for the same amount of AP. So we're gonna see how well No Fly Zone does in the pass rush. And let's see if we can get after the quarterback, all right? See y'all boys in there. All right, Joker Fam. So there goes, oh, we're proud of ourselves again. There goes Patrick Mahomes, Justin Jefferson, and I believe it was OBJ. And there go our Raider boys right there. So let's go ahead and get into it. All right, Joker Fam. So starting on offense first, let's see what we can get going here. Uh, the safeties over top might play this. At the same time, I don't know if this is a blitz either, so this could be bad. All right, no, it's not a blitz. We'll take that, though. Let's go. Thank you, Rob. Put that on the curl route. I imagine it'll come out in the same blitz. Yeah, got it that time. I'll take that. Let's go, Odell. Let me see what we got here. Yep, walk it to the ooh, Gronk. Gronk put him on his back. I'll take that, man. Let's go. All right, Joker Fam. So on no fly zone now. Let's see what we can get going here. Let's see if we can, if Tuck can get us some pressure. Ooh, that's kind of on me. That's kind of on me. I thought that was, thought that was AJ for a second. I was gonna be real pissed off. Come on, man. Where's my inside stuff at? Oh, let's go. Hot 
Ah! Do it for the so gameplay, happy. baby. Thank you. Come on. All right, Dripper Fap. So, hey, no fly zone. Held up. Ben don't break. I'll take it. Justin Tuck already got himself a sack. So, so far, so far, so good, man. Got him. Got him. Got him, coach. Let's go. OBJ. Thank you. Need that, baby. Come on. You're kidding me. Why didn't it... Why didn't Deep Round knock out Brock? Like, at all? All right, Joker fam. So, we're back on. Back on O'Fly Zone. I really don't know how Casey Hayward just gave that up. Just no ability proccing, nothing. Like, I, I don't understand. That's another thing I don't get to. I, I have three inside stuffs on this field. It seems like only Mario is getting any any sheds. I don't get it. Man, oh man. I, I don't I don't know what else to do. I really don't. I'll take that. Let's I don't know. Let's just keep it moving, I guess. We just got to do what we got to do on offense. We'll figure it out on defense, I would hope. Let's go, Ken. I'll take that. I, I'll, I'll take that. Let's go. Hey. Come on, bro. Need it, baby. Come on. That better be my pick. <laughs> Thank you. Got him! Thank you. Thank you, Showcase. Thank you. I was not leaving that one up to chance. Absolutely not. You got away with one. That's all you get away with. Putting it out there. I'm putting it out there. Don't care. Let's go. Let's go. Keenan Island. I need it, baby. Come on. No. I... Mm. Oh my god. I can't believe I did that. We really celebrate, bro. I right, man oh man. Alright. It is what it is, man. I thought I would have had enough room that Sandcastle wasn't gonna get there, but Guess I was wrong. Alright, he just warped right in front of the ball. It is what it is, man. Good blocks. Good blocks. Good blocks. Two more. Two more 10 yard rushes. Yep. 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 I'll get behind my blockers on that one. Got him. Dummy. Stupid. Come on. I'm trying to run commit. Get out of here. Or do something like that. Good pick. Oh, you want to celebrate, right? You want to style my... I got you, dog. I got you. Let's celebrate. Come on, bro. Yeah, nah. Yeah, exactly. Hell yeah. My celebrating leading you to you quitting, bro. Let's go. All right, Jugger Pep. Hey, great top three. That's what I like to see, bro. Josh Allen. At least it was my top three. All right, so not bad. Let's see what we can get into, bro. All right, let's see what we got here. Starting on no fly zone. Audible to start it off. All right. Allen gonna go to the air right away. Mm. Okay. All right. Let's see what we can. Let's see if we can lock him up now. Okay. Oh, Charles Woodson. I need you to make a break on that, man. Let's go. Good tackle. Are you kidding me? Bro. Nah, man. Nah, bro. Nah, nah. Stop. 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 No way. All right, Jeremy. I'm on offense, man. I, I really am 
upset about that that last drive because that that really should have been a stop i played underneath and everything like we should have easily had a stop you really missed that block yeah good block see that's what i need downfield keenan allen that's what i need i need that kind of blocking downfield thank you come on all right Joker fam. back on all fly zone let's see what we can do what we got to do here man And it doesn't start with that, that's for sure. These Thank nuts. you. Yep, keep you on clock. That helps me very much so. All right, Joker fam. So, 30 seconds left. Homeboy held me to three. It is what it is. We'll take that. We'll take that. We'll take that. What in the hell? Oh, okay, I gotta know when he's coming out and that it's gotta be Bunch Trail. I just gotta know it. That's that's on me. I gotta know that. All right, Joker fan. Second half, man. Let's go ahead. Do what we need to do, man. I got the only thing I need to worry about really is that Bunch Trail. That's it. Oh my God. Let's. Yo, I, I swear on everything, Keenan Allen is setting that outside, that outside corner. He's just getting shoved out the way. Outside of maybe like the first play of the game, Keenan Allen has been just pushing this corner around all game long. All right, back on no fly zone. Let's see what we can do, man. That's all. We got to lock up what we, need, what we need to lock up. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Come on. What are you doing, Eric Berry? Break the ball up. See, what was the problem with doing this last time? Eric Berry, <laughs> what the heck are you doing? How are you getting routed up like this? All right, Joker, so that's gonna be in the gameplay. As it is, man, I'm very disappointed in that last game. First game, it is what it is. Defense played well to an extent. At least Justin got a sack. Um, I really don't know what's going on with edge players having inside stuff. I have no idea what the problem is because these dudes just don't don't shed ever and i and i believe if i'm not mistaken i believe they're actually procking they're just not getting off of any blocks i really don't know why what the problem is but is what it is i it, i don't care enough honestly I, I might just take the ability off but i don't know i'll cross that bridge when i get to it as it is last game at least my dbs weren't doing nothing eric berry would get toasted one play have a, a great break up the next play and then get toasted the very next just turn in the circle so and and as it is i have i have to keep him on my field because ap wise i have to do it sadly um but that last game was that last game was really bad it was justin tuck got one sack out of out of two games and he just did nothing and this guy was passing quite a bit the second game dude was passing quite a bit and the fact that tuck couldn't get nothing not no pressure nothing and maniac is not getting no sheds on the outside or nothing that's worrisome that that makes me think i might be better off just and, and on top of that maniac's not getting any pressure even with his x factor so like maybe it's that time to get reggie white i don't know man Y'all let me know in the comment section below, cause I like Tuck. Again, he is just essentially an upgrade to Max. But again, there's so many, there's so many questions that need to be asked. Is inside stuff not working the way it's supposed to? 
because I don't have Max Crosby's X Factor activated, where they where he wipes all the blocking resistance. Could that be why? Is it? Do I just need to take that completely off? Take inside stuffs completely off because they just don't work on the edges? I, I don't know. Do I need to get rid of Maniac because he's just not even getting any pressure? Like none. Even with the X Factor, he's not getting any pressure. So I, should I just not even bother with three AP on him and just rock out with with um, Reggie White and <clears throat> Reggie White instead? Like I don't know, man. Y'all let me know in the comment section below. But where I am right now, as far as my D-line goes, man, if inside stuff's not doing what it's supposed to, dog, Maniac might be gone. Because granted, yeah, I, I get more pass rush with obviously the unstoppable force off that edge. But if it's not getting off, if it's not getting sheds, if it's not getting in the backfield, I might as well just go, go get Reggie White. And probably free up one. Actually, I will be freeing up one AP from even just doing that too. So, okay, man. I we'll we'll see. We'll see. I'll see what happens. Y'all, let me know in the comment section below. All that inside stuff. Is it worth it for your edge guys at least? And hey, do we need to move Maniac? Do, do we gotta do we gotta go pick up Reggie White and move Maniac? But either way, Joker fam. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay, man. If so. Make sure you guys drop some laughs on that like button. And also, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, man. We're on the road to 10K. Make sure you guys hit that sub button, man. Let me take one second. Let me say I'll catch you guys in the next one. All right? Peace.